sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Argentina up against Portugal. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Good and fair challenge. The Argentina first team. Cristian Romero starts alongside Lisandro Martinez in central defence. Lionel Messi starts with Nicolas Gonzalez on the flanks. And leading the line today is Julian Alvarez. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. Oh, good save. Argentina doing well to regain possession. And defensive play to be applauded. Well, failure to keep the ball by Argentina. Silva. It's with Joao Cancelo. Seemed to switch off for a moment. And now a throw in. And he's beaten him here. And what a magical save it was! Going short. Determined defending. It is then. Messi. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Bruno Fernandes has it. And Messi with teammates to play it to. To take the lead. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Messi with the corner. And swept out of there. win the throw following that challenge Bruno Fernandes has it here's Ronaldo really getting stuck in throw in for Portugal coming up Ball back with Argentina now. Can he put it away? And it's in! 1-0! They've breached the defence! Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? He's 
in here. Oh, it's a super save. Well, he always looked in control of the situation. That's a top-class save. Delivering it. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. Ronaldo. Nuno Mensch. Well, there's a really stylish piece of running. And take it away. Palinha. Good idea. Messi just needs to remain composed. Keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Well, that's splendid play. Here's Alvarez. Could be. It must go in, surely. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. So, underway again, with Portugal looking to find a route back into the game. Messi, excellent vision. Is this the moment? And the referee has given the corner. So many scope here for them to add to their lead. Who can they pick out? Well, a bit short with the clearance. And a goal! And you've got to say, they definitely took a deflection off the defender. Well, let's take another look. And there's the deflection. And from that moment on, the keeper had no chance, did he? here and the ball is moving again well I just sense Argentina have had a change of heart here about the way they're going to play they really are just trying to dominate the game by controlling possession the only problem is they're going to try and do it in deep areas which can be very risky it's an interesting move well it would have taken perfect technique from that sort of range and that was less than perfect uh, not a good decision from him that's a waste of possession there Ronaldo. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. And a throw in for Argentina. Well, Portugal had more of the possession, as you can see, but it means nothing unless they start to be more creative, particularly in the wide areas. Up to this point, they've been too easy to defend against. De Paul. Nice weight on the pass. Now the task is to remain focused. Well, I think it's accurate to say that wasn't part of the shooting plan. Well, that's a poor effort. He has to do better in that sort of situation.
Rafael Leao. Well, spot on with that challenge. Trying to open them up. And he might be in here. Well, goodness me. Well, even though he tried to place it into the corner, he's missed by quite some distance there. So a personnel change then. Really closing him down here. Silva. Bruno Fernandes has it. It's a weighted pass towards Cristiano Ronaldo. And quite simply, wide of the target. It's a neat move. He's in here. Oh, he's given us away. Joao Cancelo. Silva. Now the quick counter attack could be on. Really annoying for them. Couldn't take advantage. And he's in. effort was always going wide he's not going to be best pleased with himself now they're going to alter things here's the substitution Ferreira Bernardo Silva clean challenge could be dangerous, and turns it through, and still danger here, well he gave it real leather, but miles off target. Well it comes down to the final five minutes. Good tackle taken away. Bernardo Silva. Shot up. Could reduce the deficit. Oh dear. That moment might come back to haunt them. A bad miss. You sense that had to go in if they're to turn this around. They simply haven't been at the races today. As far as stoppage time is concerned, three minutes here. Well, no foul apparently. Well timed tackle. It's looking promising. And it goes into the history books as a win for Argentina. A very satisfactory outcome. Stuart, your analysis. Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's had a tremendous game and attack, Stuart. Well, he scored one and could have had a lot more. But if you keep getting into the right areas, the goals will come. I thought he was very good today.